Now we will see how the stationary waves are formed in an open pipe. Open pipe means a pipe which is open from both the ends. And inside we create disturbance. How it can be done? It can be done practically. You have seen, you have seen God Krishna and he is having a flute. In that flute he is making the disturbance inside air but he is throwing air from this corner. That is window here. This side is open, this side is also open. So that is example of open pipe. Now in that open pipe the disturbance is created inside and that creates the waves. Now because this is a closed system and this is an open system so there is a boundary here. Closed system to open system and whenever there is a boundary there will be some reflection. So there are certain reflection from this boundary, from this boundary and because of these reflection there is superposition and superposition takes place. What, how do we know that superposition has taken place? Resonance will take place and we will hear a loud sound. That happens for the first time when we hear this sound then there is a stationary waveform in this way. So this gives us basic tone. Basic tone. How much should be the frequency of this basic tone? We know the velocity of the sound in the air. It has certain value that is V. Okay. If we know what is the wavelength here, lambda, then we can always calculate frequency. Frequency is velocity upon lambda where V is velocity and we know the velocity of sound in the air or in any medium. Now, when the first time a stationary wave is formed, we remember a rule. At the open end, there is a freedom of displacement. There is no binding. So, node cannot be formed at the open end. Only anti-node can be formed and it has got both the ends open. So we have to make anti-node here and we have to make anti-node here. If anti-node here, anti-node here, then where is the node? Answer between the two. That is why we make node here and this is the first time the stationary waves are formed. So this is basic tone or we can say fundamental tone. or we call it first harmonic. If this has got a length L and crest to trough, crest to trough is half lambda. So here L is equal to half lambda. So lambda is equal to 2L. So what is the frequency? This is first frequency, first harmonic and this is equal to V upon 2L. This. Okay. Now, after that, along with this, we listen another frequency. There is a combination of frequency coming from the flute. And what is that other frequency overtone with a slightly, uh, maybe less loudness, but there is a mixture of the second frequency. How much is that second frequency? must be more than one node, two nodes. And for the two nodes, this is the wave formation, stationary wave. Now here, if this is the length, how can we calculate frequency? We know this is crest to crest is one lambda. So here L is equal to one lambda. If L is equal to one lambda, lambda is equal to one L, then this frequency is equal to V upon L or we can write as 2 V upon 2 L. So nu 2 is equal to twice nu 1, nu 1. So this frequency was nu 1 and this is double of it, 2 nu 1. So we call it second harmonic because it is double. Now here after 2 N this formation is also there. It is also giving us some frequency. And here we find it 
crest to crest one lambda and two trough half lambda so here length is equal to 3 upon 2 lambda so how much is lambda is equal to 2 upon 3 L okay so how much is the third frequency this is equal to V upon 2 L upon 3 this is 3 into V upon 2 L is equal to new one so this is three times the first harmonic so we call it third harmonic third harmonic and simply in the same way now you can make it three notes third harmonic four notes this is one lambda this is two lambda l is equal to two lambda so lambda is equal to l upon two frequency is equal to v upon lambda that is l upon 2 this is frequency for this this is number 4 so this we can write as 4 v upon 2 l and v upon 2 l is frequency 1 so this is 4 times frequency 1 so all these sounds we listen from the open pipe and what is their frequencies we get the frequency nu 1 and 2 new one and 3 new one and 4th new one and an nth new one. N new one. What is this N? This is any integral multiple of the basic frequency and here we get 1, 2, 3, 4. All multiples. All multiples of first harmonic all multiples of first harmonic we get in the open pipe what we were getting in the closed pipe only 1 3 5 7 here we get 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so if we listen open pipe and we listen closed pipe there is a difference in the sweetness of this sound this sound is better mixed because it has got very closed by frequencies 1000, 2000, 3000, 4000, 5000. There in the closed pipe, what will you hear? 1000 after that, 3 after that, 5. So that mixture is not so sweet as this pipe. Because it has all the harmonics, I will write it here. Because open pipe has all the harmonics which are even and odd, both. Yes, please remember this. So this is resonance in the open pipe. So, we have done examples of resonance in the string, in the open pipe and in the closed pipe. Please remember therefore, this formulas and their characteristics. Thank you.